Hey, Bree. Hey. How you doing? <laughs> I don't know. What are we doing here today? I don't know. You just told me to make a video with you and brought me over here. I You're don't right. know what we're doing. We're just going to stare at each other. This is why I stopped watching your videos, because they become pointless. Well, they became pointless, like, the first day I started making them. Anyway, reason we are making a video is we got a box in the mail today. Right here. Now, who is this box from? Well, for some reason, and I don't know what it is, Ron Haggerty, who just got done sending us, you know, that Paul Abdul record from Mrs. VV, and she's, he sent bunch of other records. He sent me another box. What's in it? What's in the box? That was for you, Ron, because we've already been there before, but thought I'd bring it up again. You know, good jokes. They're the ones you repeat. So, oops, I ripped my pants again. So, I thought you could just do this one because you haven't been on in a while because you're being all teenager-y and like, uh, I just want to be on my computer and talk with my friends. I don't want to do things with you, Dad. You're lame. Yeah, I am lame. But we're going to do stuff together. All right. What is in the, 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 the... All right, Ron. I already see something up front. Look. Ron! Ron! Ah! The first thing I see here... Is that mono pressing of whipped cream and other delights? Ugh. And it's got the sticker front and everything. Beautiful. I... As you might have been knowing, uh, Ron's been collecting uh, some uh, tea on a brass. Why? I don't know. Um, but he has. And he's got some that are pretty rare ones, too. And, oh. Ron, you've not been collecting these exactly for me, are you? Were, were you collecting for yourself and you got bored and you're sending them to me? Wow, this one's in pretty good shape. It's L&M LP110. And this is a mono also. It's a different mono. Wow. But this one doesn't have the sticker front. As you can see, it's actually the full... This has got the sticker back. You know, I I'll watch. take one of the copies if I don't have whipped cream already. I think you're eating my guy one already. I don't know. And then, a third one! Ron, what are you doing to me? And this is an LP110 also. So is this mono also? Yeah. Another. Different pressing, different labels. There are variants on here. These are all variants. Oh my god! And here's a stereo one! Oh! What the... Run! <laughs> a different stereo. You can see the different label too. My gosh, this one's still on the shrink inside there. You see it? Holy cow! I do have a stereo and a mono, but they're pretty. The mono is really rough and uh, not like the shape of these. And I, I maybe I have a double of one of these variants, but that's all I got. Another stereo. Oh, look at that. Let me guess, another whipped cream and delights. Eat your heart out, Andy Borders. Yeah, we're getting it. Look at that, another stereo. This is that, now we're up to the SP410s, 4110s. Yeah, I'm keeping an eye on the catalog numbers because I know them. And another SP4110. And as we can see, like, you guys don't get it, but look at the back. See how the label is? And then check out this one. See how the labels, the variants? All of these are different variants. None of them are identical. Wow, Ron. Holy cannoli. This is how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight copies of Herb Alpert whipped cream and other delights. And one... Mono with a sticker front. Wow. That is totally unexpected. 
I get having mono and stereo copies of a record, but having literally several copies of a record is ridiculous. You're like a drug addict, but records, if you do that. It's Herb Alpert! These are my friends. Records are my friends. The VC are my friends. Do you stop having friends if somebody's like, I'm sorry, I have enough subscribers. You're not allowed to subscribe to my channel and watch anymore. I have just enough. No, it's good to have friends, more friends. And it's also good to have more of these kind of friends, too. These beautiful green friends. Well, this is ridiculous. Wow, look at the color difference on there. These are more olive. This is more of a deep green. Oh, gosh. Can't wait to go through Discogs and catalog these. <laughs> these are going to be fun. Ron, thank you. I'm hoping this isn't all the ones you picked up. But if you have been slowly collecting these just to get them to me. Bad boy. Shamey, shamey, shame. Wow. What you gonna do when they come for you? Yeah, um... Wow, totally unexpected. So, uh, just to note, if you're not watching this, Andy, um, somebody get in touch, in touch with Borders. Ask him how many copies of, well, Whipped Cream and Other Delights he has. Because if I don't have the most now, I'm going to need to pick up my collection and start getting some more. Because uh, the competition's on. I got a good head start from Haggerty. Yes, I will be the king of Herb Alpert. At least in this household. Hopefully in Auburn, Maine, and possibly the state of, you know, Maine. But, uh, I will be the Lord of the Albert. Sweet. All right. Take care, guys. Short little video. But, man, that is awesome. Woo! Thank you, Rod. I don't know what to say. Bye-bye.